430, a story that's attracted a lot of attention. A community-wide search for a missing 14-year-old blind and deaf golden retriever has paid off in Feeding Hills. It was an Agawam man who found Chez yesterday and helped to reunite the dog with his family. Western Mass News reporter Alyssa McCann has the touching story. Dozens of community members from Feeding Hills and beyond were searching for Chez, a blind and deaf golden retriever who was missing since Monday. A Facebook post shared more than hundreds of times showed Chez walking in the rain. Finally, late Wednesday afternoon, one man was able to locate the dog. When I found him, um, I came to this location on Northwestville Street. I figured this would be a good start. I started at the other side of the fence, uh, walked down to the um, river's edge, and I wanted to see what was going on, and I kind of assessed the area. John Benarakis, a landscaper in Agawam, found Chez laying on the ground inside Robinson State Park where dozens of volunteers had been searching. Maybe five, ten minutes later, um, I saw him down by the river's edge. I made my way down there. I couldn't believe it, it was him and uh, made my way down to the river's edge and uh, I wanted to see if he was okay. The colored leaves and Chez's disabilities made it hard to tell where Chez was and what condition he was in. I saw his eyes kind of flicker a little bit and his nose twitch. Um, gave him some little bit of food and water and he took it so I know he was fighting. Once Benarakis located Chez, he put his sweatshirt around him, trying to keep him warm and comfortable. There was no reaction until I put the food like really close to him and then he started eating it and he lifted his head and I knew that you know we can get him out. Once the paramedics arrived they were able to provide a stretcher. At that time John and one of Chez's owners were able to carry Chez all the way up this embankment and bring him to safety. Benarakis tells Western Mass News he did not know Chez or his family but the moment he saw the missing dog he felt that connection. I just went straight to him it was like it was meant to be and we're happy about it. And when he witnessed Chez reunite with his family, it was rewarding and emotional. There was a little girl and their son was here and the little girl hugged me. <laughs> and it made it worth it. Since then, Chez's owners have been in touch with his rescuer and tell him he's doing great, even standing up on his own. They reassured me that he's home, he's okay. And that was nice. And after saving Chez, Benarakis has received countless of messages, but he is mostly thankful the children get their beloved dog back. I'm just glad for the kids, too, They're, that they can spend a few more years with the dog. In Agawam, Alyssa McCann, Western Mass News.